it's not seeing size. Oh wow, that place burned. Huh, haven't been to Gary, Oklahoma in a while, folks. Looks like it's drying up. We are on our way to American Horse Lake. This is one of the lake that I grew up fishing. I haven't been uh, probably 25, 30 years since the last time I was there. We've got 100 crickets, two containers of worms, and uh, hopefully we'll get in there and, and get the big uh, big sunfish. Just gotta keep still. Keep on the road. Yeah, we're looking forward to it. We probably should have gotten an, e an earlier start, but you know, you know what they say: a bad day of fishing is better than a good day of work. When we get to the when we get to the lake, I'll bring you back and let you have a look. And then uh, I didn't bring the, gro uh, the the GoPro, so let's hope we can get some decent video footage. Anyhow, we'll see you guys uh, shortly. Mile stretch of road. Look, there it is. No, just kidding. We are almost there, folks. Let's talk about a lot of memories coming back. Dad waking one of us up in the morning so we could sneak off and go fishing. And this is where we go. He never would take my brother and I both at the same time because I guess we couldn't couldn't get along well enough to do so and we both kept track of who went the last time it's some beautiful land out here too you can see for miles of course we got the African African sand blowing all over everywhere Turn in. There's the regulations. No swimming, three day camping limit. Wonka, wonka, wonka. Ah yeah, it looks looks like it's looks like the lake is back up to its normal levels. I guess uh, a while back the dam had uh, ruptured or something, and they repaired it, and the repair didn't work well or something, and they ended up having to drain the the lake down quite a bit to do some repairs. And now there it is. Only one camper, two campers maybe one boat and they do have a courtesy dock that they added to it well it, it's where is it i don't see the courtesy dock anymore well they had one all right we're fixing to go around the corner to our honey hole Yeah. Oops. These poor fellows are in trouble. There goes our day of fishing. <laughs> Didn't make it, I guess. Is there any way he could back in behind him?
Alright guys, I had to move my truck here. My brother was wanting to back his truck out of there and put it into a spot closer to where he's at. So far we've got uh, we've got eight keepers. They're about, the, about as big as my hand. And uh, the, way, uh, the way sunfish are, uh, the way I see it anyway, if it's big as my hand it goes in the pan. Anyhow, we're, it's not a bad day. We're, uh, we're using crickets. We haven't even touched the earthworms or the red wigglers. Uh, probably shouldn't have bought them. And like I said, I bought uh, I bought a hundred crickets. I uh, got uh, two creels, uh, fifty in each. And uh, man, I'm uh, running out. So I'll probably have to uh, move over to where my brother's at and uh, use his since he's not catching as many as I am. But uh, <laughs> when he sees this, he's gonna be mad. Anyhow, and as far as my buddy Aaron goes. Uh, I took some pictures of these fish so that you know what they look like. Uh, you might get something later, who knows. Uh, but you know, you know, I'll share them with you. So anyway, I'm gonna get back to the uh, back to the bank. Uh, and like I said, we're at American Horse Lake, and this is uh, probably the first time in probably about 25 years that I've been out here, and uh, this lake has always been good to us as far as uh, uh, sunfish uh, and if you get out here early enough with the top water uh, lure the bass will hit anyhow I'm gonna get back at it and I'll see you in a few all right guys it is uh, 238 that's gonna end it as far as this fishing trip goes we ended up uh, with eight so that ought to make a, a fat man a good meal. Thank, and thank goodness my wife don't like it. My brother said his wife wouldn't cook it for him. So yeah, rather than split them up, I've got them all. Uh, I'll finish rinsing them off once I get them to the house. And we're uh, put them in the freezer. It was a great day. This lake's been, it's been good just again. It's in, this uh, American horse, it's in between uh, Gary and Watonga. Some folks like it, some folks don't. Uh, you are better off. Uh, fishing out of it in a boat we bank fished it and, and ended all right so anyway that's going to bring this video to a close like i said, i wish i could have done more video and of the fishing trip but it's so windy out that all you hear is wind noise on that camera and i you know i didn't bother with it and i didn't have the gro the, the gopro with me anyway so anyhow next time we do that then i'll i'll set it up hopefully uh it won't be a windy day and won't have to worry about cameras and stuff uh, getting wind noise and blown over. All right, guys, have a great uh, rest of the weekend, and we will catch you on the next video.